Programming a blank tire sensor with the Wells programmer always begins with entering in our vehicle's information. After the vehicle's information has been entered and new sensors selected, our programming screen appears like this. Go ahead and turn on our tool and we'll select the H for Hyundai, scroll to our Santa Fe and select 2013. We'll select new sensor and our programming screen is here. In this video, we're gonna be talking about programming a blank sensor. After entering in our vehicle's information and selecting new sensor, our programming screen appears. We have auto duplicate, manually duplicate, and program blank sensor. But before we go ahead and select to program blank sensor, we need to install our sensor into the tool. To start with, I'm gonna install the wrong sensor to show you guys what happens. I put in the wrong sensor, lock it in, and press program. Immediately the tool beeps saying incorrect sensor, insert a 315 megahertz sensor. Take it back out, put our correct 315 sensor in, lock it back in place, and select program. The tool will erase any information that was on that sensor, program the vehicle's information into it, and verify it's correct. Upon successful programming, the tool will beep twice. The sensor is now ready to be installed into the tire and onto the vehicle. Programming a blank sensor is commonly used when you're unable to auto duplicate or manually duplicate a sensor. Most vehicles do require that this new sensor ID be programmed into the vehicle's computer.